Okay, that's odd. It must be a thing about being protectorate. I uh, I stopped the <clears throat> the rebels from controlling it, but then it went to the knights. But because the knights aren't involved in a war, it went back to me. Right, I need to break you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine friends. So it would cost me 90% war score to get rid of that. But if you had no friends, then I could disassemble you quite quickly. The bad side to that is that the accursed defender of the Catholic faith would probably keep jumping in, whoever it is. The Hansa. Although I just need to get myself involved with the Hansa once. I could break Austria apart. I could give it a go at least. Jake, the rebels are close to enforcing demands. That's okay. It's just the uh, it's just the Shinto guys, and I don't care about their demands. Nobody does, because they are pathetic. All right, Romania bites the dust. Ferrara bites the dust. to raise a 40 st uh, sorry 25 stack behind my back however my vassals are keen to put them to sword ah and Castile is keen to sink my navy my own fault for taking my eyes off the prize there them blockading that one province they can't do any harm Jake who are your vassals I must have missed a big chunk these are my vassals Lithuania Poland Hungary Ottomans Brandenburg and Denmark and Bohemia but that was an error on my part because Austria culture converted all the former Czech lands bummer biggest fan of Austria being able to raise all these armies, so let's slap armies down on the, the rest of his lands. Total annexation of you will give me 80% over extension. I currently have 10, so that's okay. Don't like those Umbrian patriots, especially not with their 3-4 general, so we're just giving their demands for now. Enjoy the local autonomy and hope they don't rise up again. <sighs> okay, well, I'm getting all this land occupied. However, that land is fairly meaningless because it's overseas. Libya, also overseas, but it's got a land connection to my capital, so it probably means a bit more than that. Oh, okay. It has 0, 0.00 effect on war score. Whereas the lands I'm occupying from Austria give me uh, an actually existent amount. Alright, that, uh, that attack on Sundao. Not my greatest military genius ever. on the go. 
get us a fresh 10 over there. Meanwhile, our, uh, our, our manpower pool is actually recovering, so I'm happy to see that. I'm going to get you on that province so I can send the 7 stack into Verona. Is it Verona? No, Venezia. Don't know where I left my head this morning. Vassal's doing a fantastic job of intercepting uh, Austria's stacks. Question is, how do I deal with the Pope in this? And what's my individual war with Austria? Oh, it's tiny. Hmm. I might have a plan, though. Kind of relies on getting Austria sieged up on the double. I, uh, I'm very low on troop numbers. Remember when I started this war with about 400,000 men and I'm down to 139 regiments? That's what uh, a few bad battles in the late game can do to you. Next vassal malice should be gone by now. Let's see. It is. That's great. That is really good. All right, Rome went down. After all this, uh, all this fighting, my troops are want going to want to relax with some uh, Roma therapy. All right, peace offer from Castile. They want three provinces. Four. And the vassalization, yeah, you're not. You can have the whitest of pieces with potentially a concede defeat. Alright, we're slowly worming our way across this land. Just a shame Austria has so many provinces here that are taking ages. Why are they taking so long anyway? 10% for the town hall, 20% for military frontier, which I think is their national idea. Defensive mentality, lock power. Oh, jeez. Well, it used to be that uh, Lucky Nations got 25% extra fort defense. And that's why wrecking the Holy Roman Empire in my very first EU4 Reiki World Conquest was such a ball ache. I was not laughing, and yet I was laughing. Alright, that's you taken care of. We'll just lay down what we need. We'll assist you, and then we're going to take care of these two provinces, and then we're going to wrap up Austria like a Christmas Prezi. Actually, no, what we'll do is we'll help out you and then move the rest over there. Because I want 100% on this guy. Otherwise, he will never accept me as his master. Oh, -ho! well, Korea tried. They failed, but they tried. So nice. Gonna need my troops to arrive there a bit faster. Ah, Aragon saves me. For the wipe. Jake, you can end the war with the Pope. I could. 
I definitely could, couldn't I? <coughs> Excuse me. Hansa, you are massive in terms of war score. And you're allied with Bavaria, Austria, Munster, Utrecht. Hmm. Just how far can I push this? Well, we're in halfway, let's go all the way. To roll down. Do I think I already have troops going to ride for? No, you guys got stuck. Onwards, help at that battle. Alright. The hands are getting involved in ways I really don't want them to. However, annexing the Pope brings with its, brings in some uh, some troubles of its own. I'm going to have to sit on the Pope for a while. It's unfortunate, but that's what we're going to have to do. Ooh. I'd love the Hansa to not be in this war, though. Those troops are going to come over and munch me. Well, potentially. I mean, they might not. I'm just so lacking in troops right now, it's unreal. Alright, that's brilliant. That's also quite nice. Loads of ducats. We'll win this European war yet. DDR blockade the hands out of peace out with them. Mm, potentially, but I don't think that'll give me enough war score. Well, sinking their fleet might help, though. Come out to play. Alright, so he's taking care of that. fast for me. Probably distracting me with his boats so his army can crush me. You know what? Here's how we'll do it. I'll detach enough of a blockade here and the rest can go around. We'll see what we get out of it. You fight Brittany which puts you at war with who exactly? GB. GB has alliances with nobody of interest. Okay. Nothing important going on there then. See, Austria feel like they can buy their way, out, their way out with money, but when it comes to me offering money, the AI is just saying, nope, having none of that, boss. In fact, apparently there's nothing I can offer them. That can't be right. Oh, they get a massive bonus for making gains. If they didn't have that, then... I'd still be far too short. Well, let's just keep the pressure piling on over here then. <sighs> DDR, you've forgotten Austrian province in the northwest. I hope that isn't true. Unless you mean this one. 